We got London on the track. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Chantel and if you are not, hola, como estas? Buenas noches. Today we are getting straight into this V-Pop wig installation. It's a really quick video because there wasn't much involved, hence the easiness of this install. But I'm just going to pause and let you guys watch. And this is just a continuation of the U-Part slash V-Part wig series. I'm just going through different vendors, seeing which ones I think are best. And I gotta give it to the V-Part wig just because the leave out is extremely minimal and that is me all over. Anyways, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and I'll catch you in the description box as well as the comments. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it, man, I swear that she can get it. Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high, hands up high, hands up high. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it, man, I swear that she can get it, man, I swear that she can get it. Every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it, every second, every minute, man, I swear that she can get it. This is how you make me feel Lips lost, teeth white Apple bottoms, let me bite Spend the night, catch a flight We can do a bunch of light Feeling bright, you smelling good Let's get this understood If you a bad bitch, put your hands up high Hands hey up guys, high so I'm coming to you a couple days later Basically just to give a quick update on the unit As you know, I did decide to film a three-part you part wig series it was just a mini series because i kind of wanted the content to remain interesting essentially the wig was pretty good um i actually really took well to the fact that it was a v part as opposed to a u part i do have another wig that i want to try out which is a u part but a side part so i'm really intrigued to see how that goes and how that comes out but essentially my general review of the unit itself was at least a good solid i'd give it an a 7.5 probably not an eight or higher just because i really do have a small head as you can see so sometimes trying to get units to fit me very well can be a bit of a challenge but generally speaking the construction from the placement of the clips at the very top as it was a v part for a middle part was exceptional i had four clips so two on each side at the top followed by one on each side and i believe one at the back in terms of how the unit laid, obviously my hair was relaxed so ultimately that will give it a better foundation to sit on. But generally I did find that the unit just was a lot smoother than the previous unit I wore and that isn't to, to discredit the other unit, it's just about preference and personally which one I prefer. So yeah, definitely thanks to Wiggins Hair for sending me that beautiful unit. I haven't dyed it and as you saw I did cut a few minor layers in the hair just to frame my face a little bit because we're not all the same are we everyone needs a bit of adjustments a few amendments and a bit of construction just to kind of tweak it to to best fit our personal style so yeah generally speaking a big fan of the unit and yeah for those in between styles or if you really just don't want to commit to tapings you don't want to commit to braids you don't want to commit to a set style sewing whatever it be you part wigs are definitely the way to go so yeah probably when i get ready to take out my tapes that view part is going back in especially over my other you part wig so yeah big thanks to the sponsor wiggins hair and stay tuned for the last wig that i will be reviewing um which will be the side part wig coming soon shortly either after my taping video or after my you part wig video so yeah thanks once again for watching and don't forget to like comment and subscribe as always See you guys.